And then when they're ready, they can glide away in the air really high up, up high in the clouds. I like to watch butterflies. We got something cool in the mail from insectlore.com. We have butterflies today. Butterflies, and, yeah. And the little house. And we've had these before. We raised butterflies with them before. But it was a different kind of house. It was all mesh all the way around. Had a window in front. And there's butterflies included. They're in there. Actually sleeping right now. They're getting longer. And they're going to turn into the cocoons later. And they're going to turn into pretty butterflies. Yeah, they're going to turn into pretty butterflies. And we'll be able to put them in here and see them good through the window. And in the box, let's show them what's in the box. Here's the butterfly. <laughs> the one opened up for us. That's cool. It just pops out of there. There's the butterfly farm. The, is it popped out like, yeah, I'm ready. It's ready. It's ready to raise some butterflies. At the side here is where you put in the butterflies. See this little zipper thing? As Ooh. they change from the chrysalids to the butterflies, we can watch them change and grow. It'll be really cool. Now, the butterflies don't come in this box. What you get is a voucher. When you get the voucher, you go on the insectlore.com website, put in your code, and then they'll send you the butterflies. So we did that, and about three or four days later, they sent us the caterpillars that are going to turn into the butterflies. They're starting to turn into poop. Yeah. One is already starting to turn in. We've had these for about a week, but there's some on the side, and there's some that are starting to attach to the top of it, and it says after about seven to ten days, they'll start forming a chrysalis. The stage. Yeah, and they'll spin some web around themselves and attach themselves to the top of this lid of the cup. And, and they'll hang down. They'll hang down and form a chrysalid, a little cocoon around them. Yep. Later afternoon, butterflies. Before too long, butterflies. Yeah. So we're gonna watch them do that. And they're going to turn into some beautiful painted lady butterflies right before our eyes. Will that be cool? Mm -hmm. And what are we going to do with them after they turn into butterflies? Let it go. So they can have a happy life, right? Yep. These guys probably need about three or four more days before they turn into chrysalids. And then we can transfer them into the butterfly habitat. After they have formed their chrysalids and attached to the top of the lid there. You're supposed to let them harden for about three days. We're at that point now. So you take the lid off. You're supposed to clean off all the little webbing there, all the silk that they formed, and then turn it on its side, turn the lid on the side, put it in this little fake plastic log, and put it in the farm. I mean, I see like four of them that look like they've attached to the lid. Three that attach to the lid, but one that attach to the side. So I don't know about that guy, what's gonna happen, but we're gonna take the lid off real carefully. The three of them came up with it, and one is kind of shaking, so they're, it's kind of agitated in there. And one of them fell to the bottom of the cup. We're gonna try to rescue them, but I don't know how that's gonna work. It says you can turn it on its side like that. Okay. Get rid of all this Gunk. extra silk and stuff so that when they come out, they don't get stuck to it when they turn into butterflies. They're like strong wet. Warm stuff on them, that means like the cover on the butterflies right now. They're making their way out. They're, it says cover peeking out of the butterfly. Oh, okay. They're just trying to open it up. Yeah, they're gonna take like four or five days to yeah. turn into butterflies. It says that actually it's gonna take about a week to 10 days. So we're going to lay them down in the log there. We've got three that attached. When they're going to attach the butterflies, they're going to be the only butterflies that are running for. There's two there that I don't think made it. What about that one? Could you still put it in there and try? Maybe I'll attach him with a piece of tape. Can you see it going? Yeah. That one wanted to fall off, so I just put a little piece of tape over the top of the silk to hold him on there. So we're going to put him in there and just yeah. leave him alone. Yeah. So we have them in there in the butterfly farm and we're going to go put them inside. You're supposed to keep them away from cold and drafts and 
direct sunlight. Keep them indoors and control their climate. So we're gonna put them away and maybe in about a week, we're gonna have butterflies. We've got four butterflies that have hatched now. We didn't actually get to see any hatch out. It seemed like we'd wake up in the morning and there'd be another one that came out. But out of five that we had, four survived. Don't know why the other one didn't make it, but it looked like it was having trouble with its chrysalid. But they're eating some sugar water that's on those sponges and feeding on the watermelon. And they look like they're doing pretty good. I like this enclosure much better than the other one that we had that was mesh all the way around. With the clear front, you can see them really good. There's some clover I put in there to see if they'd like that. You can see that butterfly feeding on the watermelon. What are we doing with the butterflies today? We're letting them go. They're the garden, they're thing. They're being friends right now. Four. You got four? Yep. We're gonna take them where? Great Grandpa's house. And they live out in the country, so they'll have a good home there. There's a big farm there. They've been flapping around in there, practicing fly. how to fly a little bit. Yeah. yeah. And then when they're ready, they can glide away in the air really high up. Up high in the clouds. I like to watch butterflies. I like to watch them open their wings. That's what I like to do. I think they're exercising. They're getting ready. Get going. Hi. Hi. Taking care of the butterflies. Mm-hmm. We're gonna let the butterflies loose out here. It may take them a while to come out. There he went. There he went. Oh, one of them. Where you go now? Hey, go, go he went out. over that way. Didn't he? All out over the garden. He went to the garden. Yeah. Oh, he's he pretty smart. Our garden. Here. Look, there another one's gonna come out. Getting them, getting on those flowers. There. See another one. Mm-hmm. He's in there somewhere. He is. Stand going. I think he's just, like trying to open his book and then he'll fly out. Hey, Cohen, do you remember the names of all four of them? Flutter. Flutter. Mm -hmm. Wings. David. And Vicky. There, there he goes. goes. There, they're all out. There he goes. There he goes. Oh, oh, he's going up in the air. Where'd he go? He's went over that way. He's One there. there. One right over here. What do you think the butterfly's saying right now? I'm eating my flowers. Yeah. I like to chill and eat my flowers. Chill and eat his flowers. He likes to hang out on a flower and he likes and drink all the juice out of it. It's 